In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix the divided by zero error here in Google Sheets. So let's say you're doing some average revenue for your data. Here's my example. I have the revenue, the days operated, and the average revenue per days of operation. If I double click on this one right here, here is my formula. We have our revenue divided by our days operated, which will give us the average revenue per days of operation. And you'll also notice that on these cells right here, we have the divided by zero error. Now that's because the cells that we have right here are blank, which is equal to zero. So the formula is this one divided by zero is equal to this error right here. Now, if you encounter this error, the only solution to this is to place some values onto these blank columns right here. But of course, make sure that it's not a zero as well because it will still give you the same error. If I put something right here, let's say they operate for 100 days. If I press enter, that error will be gone because now it's not divided by zero. It's divided by something higher than zero. So let's undo that. Now to fix this error, if you do encounter it in a spreadsheet, maybe a future one, or let's say in this case, the person in charge of this branch hasn't reported their days of operation yet. So what we're going to do here is to add a function called if error. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's edit our formula. Just after the equal sign, you're going to be putting in if error. There we go. And here's our syntax. We have the value, which is this one right here, comma, and the value if we are given an error. You can leave this blank if you don't want to keep seeing that error right there. If we press enter, there we go. That is what it's going to look like. But let's say you want to put in a reminder for the person trying to fill in or to complete this data set to put in the days operated on that column or on that space right there. So we're going to put in a message saying, fill in the days operated. If we press enter, that is what it's going to look like. Let's add a period on that one. There we go. Adjust this column to fit in our text. Now, if I drag this down, we're just going to format that in currency again. And there you have it. So now those errors are replaced with a reminder that for you to not get that error, you have to fill in the days operated. If I fill it in, let's say 120, that message is gone. And now we have the correct value that we're looking for. Again, if you fill this in as well, there it is. So that's how to fix your divided by zero error here in Google Sheets. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, do leave a like and subscribe for more helpful videos. See you on the next one.